everybody, welcome to my channel. This is Nora with Nora's Fun Finds, and today I bring you another Dollar Tree haul. Um, today is uh, a small haul, so the video will be a short one. I am currently out of town with my husband. He took me he uh, took me away for a little weekend getaway, and of course I had to visit their local Dollar Tree. Um, actually, the city has four, but I only went to one today. And um, I found some stuff that I had not seen in the local Dollar Tree in my state. I am from California, and I am visiting Nevada. So I just wanted to share with you some of the stuff that I found that I have been wanting. And I actually had to come out of state to find it. So um, the first thing I'm going to show is food, which is just junk food. Um, it's just stuff I bought to eat while we're in our hotel room. They have this back at home, but... Uh, um, like I said, some of the other stuff I, I could not find in my local Dollar Trees. So, with that said, let's go ahead and start with um, food, my junk food, and we'll start with candy. Um, so, one of my favorite candies that the Dollar Tree carries are these um, chocolate parfait um, nips. So, it's a caramel outside with the creamy chocolate inside. Um, these are so good. And they, this is a four ounce bag. And if you can see that, um, I just grabbed one. It's just for me to eat while I'm here and for um, on our way home. So I got one of these bags. Now for my husband, who also likes candy but cannot eat it because he is diabetic, I found the Werther's Original Chewy Caramels. They're sugar free. And I feel like maybe there's about maybe six pieces in here but I got these for him um, so he could also have something to snack on while he's while we're in our room I got him those I also found some sugar-free wafers the vanilla uh, by Pampa this is a seven ounce package this is not a reduced calorie foods artificially flavored but it's sugar-free and again like I said he is diabetic so um, I don't want to have to eat my cookies in front of him. So I picked these up for him. I also found, which is new, I've never seen these before. I mean, I've seen them, I believe it's called Minis cookies, but not these yogurt flavored ones. This is an eight, there's eight in a package, and these are yogurt, Greek style yogurt cream um, sandwich cookies. So you can see that. Okay, my lighting is kind of off. I am uh, filming in my hotel room while my husband's out gambling. So I have the, uh, this is, uh, the flavors are blueberry, strawberry, peach, and vanilla yogurt. And again, there's eight packages in this box. So I grabbed one of those to try. And I seen this, um, the, the pastries in a haul, uh, Oh, it was a long time ago, and I've never found these, and I wanted to try them. And um, someone by the name of Thrifty Tiffany actually showed them in her haul, and they looked really good. So I finally found them here. They're the scrumptious puff pastries with the strawberry filling. There are four packages, four individual bags in this package. And there's four pouches, two little puff pastries in a, pa in a pouch. And it's uh, serving, of course, serving size is two. And I'm not sure who actually makes this. Europe, oh, it's by European Confections. And they are actually from Las Vegas, but this is a product of the Ukraine. So it has uh, like a jelly inside. I actually bought two of these. I did open one, so I want to sh go ahead and show you what they look like inside. So let me grab my open package, and this is what they look like. So they're just uh, bite size, And of course, I already tried one, and they're really good. So I did grab two of those. I also grabbed these. These are lollipops. They're DC now, this is a joker. Not too sure who this is, but my grandson did uh, tell me he would like a Marvel, Marvel DC theme um, 
Easter basket. So I'm going to put these in his basket. And they do open up. And there's a sucker inside. Same goes with this one. Now they had a, a variety of these kind. They have a SpongeBob, Patrick, uh, Paw Patrol. Um, what other character? They had a few characters. I can't remember all of them. But these are the only two DC ones that I found. So I went ahead and picked those up for my uh, grandson's Easter basket. And that's all I have for junk food. And let's see, what else do we have? We will go ahead and show crafts, but I just grabbed stickers. Um, I did find, I thought these were cute, by, these are Jot stickers and they're by Jot. And I found the swan with the star and I'm not sure if you can hear it, but you can see the little confetti inside. Here of the feathers of the swan. So I've got the swan. I found this really pretty cougar. And she's got silver confetti inside. And then I found the dinosaur with this cool drink that says, Let's party. I thought these were really cute. So I picked up um, a few of these. I also found these dinosaur pop up stickers. There's 10 pieces, and they're like 3D, and I like I like the metallic colors. And again, this will also be going into an Easter basket. So a lot of the stuff I'm going to show is for uh, Easter and going into the baskets. I like making my own because um, you can put whatever you want. And of course, the Dollar Tree is a perfect place to go and find um, some little toys they put in there that the kids will like and play with for a while. So, anyways, I also found these stickers here are the flowers, and these are metallic, and this contains 10 pieces. And of course, all these are from Crafters, Crafter Square. I found these really pretty butterflies with the vibrant colors. There's four in a pack, and they're just really, really pretty. And I just grabbed one of these. I also picked up some glass stickers. Uh, let's see. So I found, there's four pieces. This one says, I love Paris. This one has the, I believe the infinity symbol, what says you and me. And it says love and kiss. And I'm, sure, I'm gonna use these to put on either glass or um, tumblers. So I grabbed a few of these and then I found this one here which is Dream with the Dream Catcher. So I grabbed those and then I also found some clear stamps. I got this one here that has the hearts, love, kiss. It says I love you. I grabbed one of these and then I grabbed this one here. Sorry about the glare. It has the dream catchers, the feathers, it says be brave. Um, they also had birds and llamas, but I just grabbed these two for now. Okay, and that's all for crafts. Next we'll go ahead and do stationery, which is um, small. I only picked up three things for stationery. First is the Jot notebook. It's just a regular notebook with plain white paper. And the stripes and I liked it because it has a little I can't open it right now I mean it, a little pocket which I could use to keep this in my purse or my car and throw some receipts in there um, that I need to that I need to save this is a five inches by seven and I just grabbed one they had these in different colors I have uh, black blue green but I picked the red because red is my favorite color. Then I found this. This is the erasable highlighters. This is the only one they had. So I went ahead and grabbed it. They had the neon pink, the neon green. Um, it says it has erasable ink. And I don't know if you can see right there where it shows that it can be erased. Again, I only picked up one. Um, and this is, I want to put in 
my stationery giveaway. And so, like I mentioned in my other videos, I want to have a giveaway when I reach um, 100 subscribers. But I want you to tell me what you would like. Would you like uh, stationery? Would you like makeup with beauty supplies? You tell me what kind of giveaway, and I will put one together. But if we go with the stationery, I picked up this, and this will go in the giveaway. And then I picked up the Dr. Seuss erasers. There are six in the package, and they're pretty thick erasers. And so the books have, let's see, they have Cat in the Hat, Green Eggs and Ham, One Fish, Two Fish, Red Fish, Blue Fish, have Thing One, Thing Two. And the, I cannot make this up. I think it's Snorting, I believe is the uh, elephant's name. But I picked up one of these. And this is also going into, uh, for an Easter basket. And that is all I have for stationery. Um, next, I'll go ahead and show you kitchen. Um, again, I only picked up a few things for kitchen. And the first thing I found was this professional corn remover. Now, I've never seen something like this before, so I had to pick this up. It's a corn cutter. It's by Good Cook. Yeah, yeah, I've never seen this, but my husband, who loves corn on the cob, but does not like to eat the corn off the cob, so he will get a knife and cut the corn off, so I had to grab this for him. I will go ahead and have him test it and let you know how well this works. This I have not seen in my California Dollar Tree, so I had to grab this. I grabbed one of those, and then I found these eco-friendly stainless steel straws. So there's four straws and it comes with its own cleaner. Let's see. It's eco-friendly, reusable, stainless steel, and of course like I said there's four. And you just wash thoroughly before first use. Wash with mild soap and water using the cleaning brush then rinse. The straws are dishwasher safe. And let's see, no cleaning brush, but the cleaning brush is not dishwasher safe. So I actually picked up uh, two of these packages. So I've got that. Next, I found this. It is a spear ice mold. So you can make, there you go, I don't know if you see that. There you go. Um, round, huge ice cubes to put in um, scotch glass. Scotch on the rocks. So I just picked up, I just picked up one. I think I should have probably picked up another one. I may go back to the Dollar Tree before leaving for home. And that's it for kitchen. The next item I will show is electronics. Um, I have been wanting some the the desk lamps. I had seen them on another haul. Um, the haul that I seen these on were, um, Thrifty Diva, Thrifty Divas, um, her name is Theoni, and I seen her haul these, and I have been wanting some, and I finally found them. I found two. So, I grabbed these two. And this takes three, no, three AA batteries, just three AA batteries, it's great for home or your office. It's flexible, foldable, portable, and it has 100 lumens. So I grabbed two of those. Next, I found some phone cases. Um, they're by Casemate. They are for the iPhone X, which I don't own. I don't own an iPhone. But um, I'm sure I know someone who does. So I picked up the three different designs. I only picked up three. This says it's made with genuine flowers. And no two cases are alike. So this has the pink and the purple flowers with some silver um, glitter or confetti inside. So I got that one. But that was pretty. And then I also found one with the clear case, but it has the gold confetti with the little gold or yellow flowers. 
Now these are all for the iPhone X. And then I found this one. It's military strength drop protection made with genuine crystals. And it's like a... The outside frame looks rose gold. But it looks kind of like, I don't know, copper? But it could be rose gold. And I picked up this one. I only picked up one of each. Um, but then again, if I do the stationary giveaway, I may put one of these in. In the, uh, I may go back and actually pick up some more. And so I can put all three in the stationary uh, giveaway. So I grabbed those. And that is it for the electronics. Um, what else? Next, I have Beauty. Now, it's not much. So, I did grab this hydrating facial mask. It is by Spa Life. It's honey with collagen. And it is a glowing anti-aging benefits 20-minute facial therapy. So, I grabbed this. I only grabbed one. Again, I may go back to the store. I should, because I think I should have grabbed some more. But I grabbed one for now. And then I found the Sheer Envy Sensitive Skin Primer by Hard Candy. This is 1.6 ounces. It's oil free, silicone free. And I grabbed a couple of these. Again, one to keep for myself, and then one. Um, for a giveaway if we go with beauty and makeup. So I did grab that. And then I grabbed more of the L'Oreal Extraordinary Clay Dry Shampoo. It's clay in a spray. And it says extends freshness between shampoos, absorbs oil at the roots, instant purity and freshness. Now I did find these back home but they only had three bottles left. So I grabbed three. But I grabbed two more so I can go ahead and put this also, um, one of these in the giveaway if we go with the uh, Makeup Beauty uh, theme giveaway. So I did grab that. And then I grabbed just a couple of the big razors. There only comes one in a package. But I did, I grabbed two. I haven't seen these in my store back home. So I did grab two, and that is it for beauty. Next, we'll do toys, which, again, this is a small haul. I don't have very much, um, I didn't grab very much of uh, things because I didn't want to haul too much stuff back home. So I did find the friendship bracelets. And, again, this will go in an Easter basket. Um... I got this for a niece, so I did grab that, and then I grabbed three different packages of tattoos. This is metallic foil, and there's 21 tattoos, and it's all uh, St. Patrick's Day theme. So it has Kiss Me I'm Irish, the Green Lips, Four Leaf Clover, Celtic, I believe it's a Celtic Knot. The Lucky Horseshoe. So I grabbed one of these. I also grabbed for an Easter basket my little pony. This has 25 tattoos. If you can see those there. So I grabbed that to go in an Easter basket. And then I grabbed the Ninja Turtles. There's 25 metallic tattoos in this package. And so I grabbed that. Actually, I grabbed this one for myself. I'm going to, so I love to do arts and crafts. So I'm going to use this um, to do a craft project. And we'll see how it comes out. So I grabbed that. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I found these Disney stickers. Now, is it some sum? So there's 300 stickers. It is based on the Winnie the Pooh and it's from Disney and Pixar so these are all these little stickers I just thought these were so cute 
Again, I have, um, I mentioned before, I have an aunt that uses a lot of stickers, so I may just send this to her. I mean, I think she would like that. So I just grabbed one of these books, and that is it. Oh, no, I have a couple more things to show the toys. Well, actually, they are just all these plastic dinosaurs, which again, are going into an Easter basket. So I grabbed that dinosaur. I grabbed a T-Rex. This is the only one I know by name. So that's a T-Rex. I grabbed this one, which I believe is a long neck. I'm not even sure if that's the real name for it, but it's a long neck. I grabbed that one. I got this guy here. And they're a pretty good size, and they're really hard plastic. So they're really sturdy. I grabbed him, and then I grabbed this one here. And these are all going into an Easter basket. And now that's all I got for the toys. And the last item I have to show are books. Now all the books I got were kids' books. And they are also, again, going into Easter baskets. I found this one here. It's called Discord and the Ponyville Players Drama Rama. And it's My Little Pony. And it is just a chapter book. So I grabbed this one. This one is originally $5.99. And I found this at the Dollar Tree. I just got one. Then I found The Secret Destiny of Pixie Piper. Another chapter book. And this one here originally sold for $6.99. And I got it for a dollar. So I grabbed that one. The next one I got is Pattyton the Bear. This is also a chapter book, but there is a few pictures in here from the movie. I thought this was cute. And I'm not sure. Oh, this one was $5.99. So I grabbed one of those. And then for my grandson, I got the official movie novel of the Power Rangers, which is just a chapter book. And that will be going into his um, basket. And this was originally $6.99. Then I found this book here by Margaret Peterson Haddix. It's called Among the Hidden, the first book in the Shadow Children sequence. So I found this one here. And this will, I probably give this to my niece. That um, She loves to read these uh, type of books. And there is one, two, three, four, five. Actually, six books in this series. And this one here originally was... Uh, this one went for $7.99. And I got it for a dollar. Now, the last two books I, bought, I picked up for my grandson... This one's called Roy's House by Susan Goldman Rubin. And it's just short and it's just short and easy reading. And my grandson is only a year, so of course I will be reading this these books to him or his parents. But I grabbed this one. This one was originally $15.99. And I got that one for a dollar. And the last book I got was Papa Chagall, Tell Us a Story. And this book is originally $16.99. And I found this for a dollar. And it's by Barron's Books. And it just has those really pretty illustrations and colors. So I picked up one of these. There we go. And that is it. As I promised, it was short and quick. And again, if you like these kind of videos, um, please feel free to subscribe um, to my channel. And go ahead and hit the like button. And again, I 
want to mention again that I am going to have a giveaway once I reach 100 subscribers. Um, I will let the um, giveaway, let you decide on what you want as the giveaway. Um, you tell me what you want and I will put a basket together. Um, again, it could be stationary. Um, it could be if you want um, beauty supplies. Um, it could be makeup, nail polishes, um, you name it, you tell me, and I will do my best to put it together. So again, that's once I reach 100 subscribers, so please, if you enjoyed these um, videos, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button, and um, also let me know what other kind of hauls you would like to see. Um, I will, I love to shop, so you tell me what you want to see, and I will go out and do it. Um, so that is it. And so I will see you soon again until our next video. Everyone have a wonderful day. Bye.